We've all been scared and we've been depressed, angry, resentful. We've been sad and brokenhearted. We've all had setbacks and struggles in life. Me personally, I've been broke. I've been fat. I've had unsuccessful businesses. I've had struggles in my marriage. But the common denominator in every single challenge that I've faced is that when I get through it, I am a stronger man because of the challenge, not in spite of it. But we have a tendency to look for ease and we look for comfort and we look for safety and security and we resist failure when we should actually be embracing it. We're so concerned with failing and what other people might think. But what if instead of running away from a challenge, we actually started to lean into it? What if instead of thinking that we're a failure because we fell just a little short that last time that we're a success because we were willing to try and we're willing to get back up and try again? It's that fire and that pressure of adversity that makes us who we are. That guy who's never had any challenges, never had any setbacks, never had any roadblocks. He's weak and he's fragile. And at the slightest sign of resistance from the world, he breaks. But that man who comes back from a divorce and he learns to love again. The guy that comes back from a bankruptcy and begins to take charge of his wealth and positively impact people in his neighborhood and his family and his community. The guy that goes through a failed business but then creates something that impacts millions of people across the planet. The guy that once was out of shape but has learned to take control of his body and his health so that he can do all of the things that he wants to do in life and help others do the same is the guy who's stronger because he was willing to get back up one more time and he realizes now that the things that he once thought were trying to tear him down throughout his life are the very things that are working to build him up.